fresh, I think. Yeah, it was so good. So we went to, um, okay, so this is the morning went. Also, welcome back to the vlog. Welcome to another video. We uh, tried to go to Paperboy on the east side, which is one of our favorite places to go. Um, it's a pretty popular breakfast spot um, here in Austin. Couldn't get in, decided to come to Jacoby's, um, which is another good one. It's more of a traditional vibe, I'd say. Yeah, it's kind of like... They have like chicken and waffles, biscuits and, and waffles. gravy, steak and eggs, kind of stuff like that. Yeah. Um, we got so the beef good. hash, um, a tomato quiche, and... Breakfast sausage. Breakfast sausage. What I really like about Jacoby's is they get all their meat from local farms and it's really high quality. So I feel good about eating there and it's delicious. But the reason we got up and went to brunch is because we are headed to the UT basketball game today. Uh, it starts at one and it's about 1230 right now. So got a little brunch and so, I think you're so. going the wrong way. Yeah, I just had to get out of there. Okay. Um, so do you want to, we're gonna drive there? I think so, but it's Saturday, got up, went to the gym, did some laundry, cleaned up around the apartment real quick, and then hit brunch, and now we're up to the game. So Texas is playing Oklahoma Sooners today. Yeah. And I think it's a rivalry game, so kind of exciting. But we have yet to go to a UT basketball game. We've been to football, we've been to baseball. Um, we haven't been to volleyball, I really wanna do that. But this will be our first basketball game, so. Very excited, and we'll show you guys our fit. When we get there, I'm wearing the Dreamer, like Texas Bevo tee. It's cute, James wearing his little camo. But anyways, if I can get the camera in, we'll bring you guys inside. saying that we love this game time. It was a 1 p.m. game. I know. Yeah, so, so we get out at like 3, the rest of the day ahead of us. I know. I love it. I wore my Evo tee. But what are we going to do? I don't know. Figure it out. What's up, gang? Made out the house. Before the sun went down. Yeah. After the game, we kind of went home and chilled for a little bit. Relax, watch some YouTube, lay down for a little bit. I feel like every time you leave a event like that, you always just leave kind of exhausted. I was always thinking I was thinking about it because I was always so used to being like sweaty and hot after. Like I just remember the Texas football games and stuff. Yeah. It wasn't that hot today, but yeah, you just kinda leave. I don't know, like we had a margarita and stuff, so Yeah, drink during the having a drink or two during the day will do that to you. But we're out at this spot called Haymaker. We're gonna grab some dinner. 6.45 right now. Um, we don't have much at the house, so. We wanted to watch the basketball game, so. Yeah. It's kind of like a sports bar vibe. It's on Manor Road. Sports bar food, bar food pretty much and is what they have. So. I don't know why wings have been sounding so good to wings me. Wings sound good. Um, any kind of dip sounds good to me. I was telling yeah. you earlier, I'm kind of over like chips and dip though right now. Kind of been having a lot of that lately. Um, with like the move and stuff, you don't really like make food. You kind of just like eat as you're Snacky. running around. So, yeah. Um, well, we did change. I kind of had an outfit meltdown. I'm not really feeling the outfit. That's okay. You look stunning. It's not okay. Though. Like ruins my day, but you look stunning. Thanks. You do. Thanks. I might need this sweater. So it's cold. Yeah. I'm just gonna bring it over my shoulders. In case we need to sit outside, I might bring my hoodie too. I just want to be more like cool girl and I'm just being more like traditional basic girl and that like just hurts my soul. I think this meltdown is a sign that tomorrow at the vintage pop-up you will find the things that really speak mm, to you. Okay. I think that's what is going on right I now. I haven't had a rent the runway order in a little bit so I'm lacking some of my like jackets and working like sweater pieces. Yeah. I'm also in a weird place with jeans right now, and that makes my everyday hard because I'm just like a jeans t-shirt girl. Yeah. And the jeans were not helping me out, so maybe on the hunt for some new denim. But anyways, I'm also starving, so. So hungry. We're gonna go and grab some food. Contributing. Um, you guys. In bed. Wash my face. We have 
a go puff delivery. We got some kind of random things. We did a cereal by Three Wishes, cinnamon, giving like healthy Cheerios, I guess. More protein, less sugar, gluten free. Yum, I don't know why I was really craving cereal. We also got a box of brownies. Are you gonna make these? Yeah. Do you want to? No. Olipop. I got a vintage cola. I have a strawberry one in the fridge, but it just didn't sound that good. So, vintage cola it is. These sounded stunning. A big Cheeto. Flaming Hot. Flaming Hot Limon. Mmm, yum. Yum, yum, yum. We needed like a variety, you know? We gotta do something spicy, like the hot Cheeto. Something sweet, like the brownie, and something gummy. We got these Black Forest gummies. I started reading all the ingredients on everything that I was ordering, and so many things on there had red dye in it. Seems like a lot of work right now. I don't really want a brownie right now. I think I want cereal. This is really much to order. Cereal and Cheetos. We like bought frozen pizza and um, gyoza at Trader Joe's. For this purpose. So we were like, oh, we're we need to stop buying like snacks like this every weekend. Here we are. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I don't want a whole frozen pizza right now. I feel like during the week, we cook dinner. We have something sweet, like a cookie. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. What show do you want to watch? Hi, gentlemen. Mm, these smell good. I had the chocolate ones in Missouri. Chocolate's way better. I would say. These aren't bad. Chocolate's definitely better. We've been really liking Masters of the Air or Sky? Masters of the Air. You always want to Dude, say Sky. I can't get it right. Masters of the Air. It's on Apple TV. Mm -hmm. Also Butler's in it. That other guy's in it. I don't know his name. But it's good. But they only come out once a week. I can't be doing that. Good morning, gang. We are on our way out the door to F45. I just made a espresso shot. I'm gonna take one before we do. Where's my... Did you want one? Yeah. What time is it? I'm gonna say I feel like we're late. Whew. But yeah, we're going to the 9.30 class. It's 9.20 right now. Luckily, wow. at our new place, we live pretty close, so it's not too bad, but it's kind of hard to find parking on Sunday, though. The sun is shining. We did lose an hour of sleep. I think it's spring forward today. We're gonna hit Howdy's Vintage after, so I'm bringing a change of clothes because it is a little chilly. Um, put some sweats and a hat. So that's the morning, but we gotta get going. Dame tricked me into a hour long cardio. It's uh, so usually, usually on Saturdays, the classes are an hour long. Um, they had an event this Saturday or over the weekend, so they switched the classes. So today was actually, Sunday was the actually hour long class and I didn't know that. I thought they just switched to Friday, Saturday. But usually Sunday is kind of like a hybrid, kind of chill. So we walked in and it was an hour usually long. Usually Sunday is 45 minutes chill, hour long cardio. I didn't really love it, but that's okay. Are you too glad you worked out though? No, I'm, I'm really glad I got to work out. And while we were sitting there, I was about to sign up for Tuesday and Thursday here this week because I really like their strength classes. Yeah. But I forgot I'm gone this week. At 45, they usually hand out like some sort of drink sometimes at the end. Um, I'm about to try this sap drink that they just. I know you're always coming home with a new drink. That's cool. But it's a plant-powered performance water, I guess. Blackberry citrus. It kind of tastes like an element. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Is it like kind of salty? Mm-hmm. I mean, there's 1,900 milligrams of electrolytes in it. Um, yeah. Um, we're gonna go hit Howdy's Vintage. Yay. It's over on East Side. Um, it's next to Fleet Coffee. We'll probably get a coffee there too. We've we been went loving there that place. Last weekend. Mm -hmm. We popped in there last weekend. Dame got that really cute red coach's jacket there. Mm -hmm. But they're having a big pop up with like a bunch of vendors today. Yeah. It's from 10 to 4. It's already 10 45. So we're going to head over there. Are we going to get a taco? Let me order a taco. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you want? Amigas? Yeah. Okay. Can I get two Amigas?
new hat. So sweaty. I like the hat. Starving. Highly debating this tea right here. Florida Seminoles. I think it's cool. It's really cute. I like Thanks. that. Jack Daniels. Hey, Tay found this pretty cool long sleeve Carhartt. I'm thinking about grabbing. Tay's got the good eye. I like this one. You got the need for speed. It's cute. I like it. I like this one and I really like. I love that one. That one's so cool. This is shopping is hard work. It's hard work. You really gotta dig. It's like overwhelming when there's so many racks here. It's crazy. But I love it. Taco secured. James up there getting a coffee, but I am so hungry. I can't even wait. So I'm starving. Oh my god. So beautiful. You like Migos or breakfast better? Migos every time I do. Yeah, gotta do Migos. That's what I did. I did two Migos. I just went to get some more green salsa though because this one is good, but it's like burn your mouth off. So, not for me. I want to show you guys what we got really quick. We got one and one, right? Yeah. Dame got. I got this kind of cute. long sleeve green Henley. It's so it's cute. It's such a good fit, huh? Yeah. Super cheap too. It's like I 15 love green bucks. On you. I know. And then I got this Harley Davidson Need for Speed. It's a little smaller, so it's more of like a like yeah. it wouldn't fit a Dame. More of like a cutie. I love the back. Like I wish this was the front, but really cute, fun. It'll look good with your pants. Little so. graphic. You guys, they had so much stuff there. I wish I had more of like a goal of what I was looking for, because yeah. like I could pick a hundred graphic tees. Yeah. Honestly, not as many Levi's as I normally see when at these markets in Austin. Yeah, Levi's or um, like Carhartt. Yeah, not really today. Not but normally at the markets we go to, they have plenty. I was kind of looking for like a pair of Carhartt pants that that those would be kind of fun to wear. But cute, yeah. Like I said yesterday, I'm kind of might be on the denim hunt. So I was looking for that. Didn't really find that, but they had so much stuff that was such a good market. I thought it was at um, Howdy's Vintage on Manor Road. Such a good find. We leave a lot of spots on Manor Road. We like love Supreme Haymaker where we went last night. Yeah. There's a little pickleball court right there. Yeah, good coffee shops, good restaurants. Yeah. Sports bars. It's a nice Food vibe. trucks, they got good mm -hmm. food trucks around. It's also not too busy on Manor. We are gonna head to the mall really quick. I'm not like super excited to go to the mall, but I have to go to this one shoe store that I think has the new balances that I need before need, <laughs> LOL, um, before my trip. So I'm gonna pop in there and see if I like them, even, even. I'm going to a trade show and we stand all day long. So having shoes. like a good, cute, comfy sneaker is key. And I've been needing a new pair of New Balances anyways. I really want to get a new pair of New Balances and a pair of Solomons. Dame says his are so comfortable. So it's on my list right now. But anyways, we're gonna head to the mall, check out some shoes, probably pop in Nordstrom as always. See what we can find. New shoe. I love them. Unboxing. I love them. I'm actually starting to carry them on a ton more sites now. I originally found them on Shopbop, but I think Nordstrom has them. Um, they're on like StockX and everything, obviously, but. How cute! New New Balances. I was getting kind of sick of my brown ones. Um, just because I wear them every day. So, a little over them, they're getting a little worn out and I need something to switch it up. And I thought it was perfect timing for the show we're going to on Wednesday, so. Anyways, these are the 1906R, I guess? But they're silver, cream, and they have a little green detailing, which is very cute. A little different than my 
other shoes, which are the 2002R. Those I got a woman's nine and a half. These I got a woman's 10. Um, these just ran a little bit smaller. I think they have a little more structure around the toe that I noticed. So sized up in these just to half size, but I think they're adorable. And I'm going to keep them in the box until I leave on Tuesday morning. I'm going to pack probably today. I need to go to the storage unit to get my suitcase out of there. That's about it. Grab a suitcase and then pack up. It's pretty easy to pack for these trips because we have assigned shirts that we have to wear for each of the days. So it should be really easy. It's very like athletic wear. So like leggings, sneakers, and then the t-shirt. So I may bring like a cute jacket or something but other than that it's like really all i have to pack in my toiletries so anyways that's all we got at the mall okay i'm gonna shower showered and we got a little hungry so we're making a little lunch um we're making a grown bowl it's exactly what it sounds like but we have the force of nature ground bison that's a staple of ours and then taste cutting up all the veggies yeah you don't really have to add veggies honestly you can do like garlic and onion and then the coleslaw mix, but yeah. we had peppers and mushrooms and stuff in the fridge, so I figured we would use them. Yeah. And it's so easy, I love it. Normally we do it with like ground chicken or ground turkey, but we're trying the ground yeah. bison today. So I love it, it's really high protein. It's literally like protein and vegetables. So it's a great yeah. meal, easy, easy weeknight meal. Yeah. And it's definitely like in our rotation now. Exactly. Definitely in our rotation. No real plans after we eat. We were talking about possibly going to um, this spot called Moody's. They have a happy hour social hour on Sunday, so we were thinking about going there and just kind of hanging. They have a really, really nice patio. It's so nice. That we were hoping. Okay. And it's really nice outside today, so. But who knows, we don't really have any plans, but we're starting to make some lunch. Ground ginger. Ginger right. powder, yeah. yeah. Ground ginger. Um, and that's about it. Put it all in the same. Stir it all up. Mm -hmm. um, but a quick rundown of like what the recipe is. So we just did the ground bison, and then we get all the vegetables we cut up. Uh, in this case, we did peppers, onions, um, mushrooms. Mm -hmm. and then we added the cabbage on top, and then you kind of mix it all together until the cabbage gets a little soft. And then uh, you're done. This is good. It's really, it's really easy. Top with like, green onion, top with like red pepper, sriracha, whatever. Super quick, easy lunch meal. So easy. Especially if you work from home, it's easy, to quick 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. We have decided we're gonna head to Ludi's um, for the little social hour. It's a really nice spot, so oh, that would be a fun little Sunday activity. We're not doing anything, and it's early. It's from five to six, so get home early, go relax. Yeah. But I thought I'd do a quick little outfit check. I have on this is actually Tay's whole wood sweater. I think it's the, is it cashmere? It's not cashmere. What is it? I don't know. Anyways, it's Tay's Elwood like knitted sweater. Um, I got my Elwood military pants on, my, oh, band-aid, my New Balance 550s, and then my green Elwood hat. So, as always, super Elwooded out. Um, and then my All Saints necklace, and then my rings. Tay has a fun little outfit on. Yeah, they have a they have this in a dark gray, with and then the Elwood um, Elwood logo is black. Be a fun one to get to. Tay has her new boots on. Still two feet us. Those ones are cool. I love these. You guys, I thought their right foot was like so small. <laughs> this is funny. Turns out I left like a piece of cardboard in there, and it was like painful. I wore them out. To Abba that night. The entire night she was like, why is my foot, it's, these ones are so small, is my foot bigger than the other one? I was like, what is wrong with these? Hilarious. But anyway, I'm wearing the new Dolce Vita, my white, I don't even know what these are. These are 
I think so. White sour denim, white free people tank, Dames vintage camo. Hey. hey. Black sunnies. Fun. It's a fun little fit. Yeah. Different. Yeah. Not what I normally wear. Okay. We are going to head out the door. I think their social hour starts at five. It's I think like 4.45 right now. So see y'all there. Cool. Just made it to Ludi's. Let's just see if we can walk in and get a table. Got a nice little seat on the patio. Got a little Sunday fun day action going on. Um, I got the old fashioned, that's part of the soul shower, and then take out the margarita. Cheers. Delicious. The margarita looks really good. It's a great Sunday spot. Yeah. Love this. They do the salt properly, fresh. Good and yummy ingredients.